Did you see the developers of the Camouflage Falls estate sent out an update recently? They've moved from finished sometime quite soon to finished sometime soon. A great step for Two Point County's most exclusive unfinished accommodation. I cannot help but think back to those birthdays of yesteryear and the sepia days of my youth. Breaking in a freshly opened hoop and stick, my sister swallowing her favorite marble, roughhousing in the parlor, the air thick with the smell of Mama's spotted dick. Ah, those are some of my favorites. Do get in touch to let us know which of my memories is your favorite.
In today's Sir Nigel Reviews, I will be reviewing birthday candles from Wickwalk, Flemington's premier vendor of candles and East Asian culinary equipment. Light, true, burn, persistent, aroma not unfragrant. All in all, an admirable effort. <laughs> If you love overpriced subscriptions with luxury packaging, uh, yes. here's the next link in the chain. Right. Sausage Box, the only bi-weekly subscription that's filled to the skin with sausages. Mm, mm, mm. Get your neighbours to say, oh wow, nice sausage box. Serving Two Point County. This is Two Point Radio. Ooh, ooh.
listening to Nigel Bickleworth on Two Point Radio. I have a message from Jerry who says, Hello, Nigel. Happy birthday. My name is Jerry. I am five years old. How many years old are you? How dreadfully adorable. Hello, Jerry. Thank you for your well wishes. Unfortunately, I don't answer such uncouth questions. Today's show has been. I can only hope that it pales in comparison to the real deal this time next month. Here's hoping that you enjoyed today's trial run. Ta ta!
Center Ricky Hawthorne on Two Point Radio. Hello to all my faithful listeners out there. This is Ricky Hawthorne, ready to pour another jar of good old-fashioned honey into your ears. And remember, the honey I'm referring to here is my voice. There's no need to panic and call in to complain like last time.
like talking into a microphone. Would you believe it? A tree came crashing through my conservatory last night. Well, no sense dwelling on the past, and the place does look greener now. Here's a nice song to celebrate. Only Jumbo Medical Solutions guarantees that you die anywhere else. <laughs> we take Jumbo Card, Jumbo Mega Card, and Jumbo Plus members are eligible for experimental treatments. Jumbo Medical Solutions. Fork it over. Ooh, ooh. 24 hours a day. This is Two, two, two Point Radio.
report released today claims that Two Point County has the best medical coverage in the country. And while it does say it can't vouch for what goes on in the Orb Wellness Centers, they're sure those are top notch too. That's good enough for me. is Ricky Hawthorne on Two Point Radio. Would you believe it? Old Henry Jobsworth, the local health and safety inspector, is threatening to close down Mary Dunk Farm. Apparently, the place is infested with cows, pigs, and chickens. Steady on, Henry.
And now the news. A dangerous animal has escaped from Grockle Bay Zoo, though the authorities have yet to reveal what species. Rumor has it that it's a nine-foot half tiger, half rhino, with a big appetite. And just think, you won't need to buy a ticket to see it. Maintenance announcement. Plants need water.
litter that you dropped on our floor. We've received yet another prank phone call asking us to raise awareness of pilfering raccoons. But I won't be fooled. Although they may look like tiny thieves, this isn't some far-fetched cartoon. This is real life.
Tired of hearing all the good things going on in the world? Sick of cheery headlines and positive articles? Then read the Daily Sneer, because good news is bad news. 24 hours a day. This is Two, two, two Point Radio. I've been informed that the local library is implementing a new policy this week. Head librarian Penelope Stuffage, tired of so many people forgetting to return books, is threatening to sneak into our homes at night and recover any overdue volumes while we sleep. So if you find your breakfast cereals arranged alphabetically and shelved by fiber content, don't be alarmed. It's just old Penelope doing her job.
I'd like you to all think of a butterfly sleepily waving its colorful wings. Isn't that a lovely image? Meanwhile, in the news today, the mayor has announced a 100% increase in our taxes. Assistant to marketing. 
Listening to Two Point Radio with your resident weirdo, Harrison Wolf. Stay tuned for some great music. You never know, we might get lucky. Ever stare into empty space and just ponder the mysteries of the universe? Like, how many planets out there support life? And what's another word for thesaurus? More existential questions after this. Thank you. 
Inject some chance into your life with probability, the drink that rolls the dice of life. Uh. Probability? What's the worst that can happen? 24 hours a day. This is Two, two, two Point Radio. Thank you. 
health and safety inspector Henry Jobsworth was seen checking into the Shore Thing Hotel in Grockle Bay yesterday. He was then seen running out and screaming this morning. Sounds about right. Is it just me or are the pointy mountains getting less pointy? We should raise some money and get them sharpened. I mean, who wants to live in the shadow of blunt mountains?
My therapist still says I need to find a hobby, so I decided to try whittling. Ever sat down with a small knife and a piece of wood? It's a very fulfilling experience. But how many stakes does one man need? The search continues. Feeling lightheaded? Please help. Not yourself? Please. Emitting light? 
What? <laughs> Whoa, thanks. Get checked at your local hospital today. This is Two Point Radio.
approaching the hospital. Our marketing director, Stacy, went to a holistic nature commune to have her appendix removed, but all they had was tree surgeons. She'll need to visit a real hospital, but at least her hair has been nicely pruned.
I read somewhere that 9 out of 10 meteors that clatter into Two Point County were originally garbage that we fired into space. You can't hide from your past, listeners. It'll come back and fall on you from a great height, even stinkier than you remember it. Never forget that.
It must get weird for you, hearing this voice coming out of nowhere every few minutes. But don't worry, I'm not inside your head. I'm just inside your radio. That's where the music lives too. Music like this. not, dear listeners, for Sir Nigel Bickleworth has arrived to elevate your radio experience beyond the mundane. But first, a piece of music.
I shall be visiting the old croc museum in Sweaty Palms later this week. I sincerely hope they have corrected the multiple cases of mislabeled geodes I spotted last time. Speaking of museums, I believe this next song belongs in one.
At Two Point Bank, we know that when it comes to your money, you want to be comforted. Roaring fires. Tasty sandwiches. The time Derek told you that joke. Two Point Bank. It just feels right, doesn't it? Serving Two Point County. This is Two Point Radio.
In today's Sun Nigel Reviews, I cast a critical eye on Crockle Bay's most exclusive nightclub, the Coba Banana. At least, I thought it was exclusive. I entered expecting class, elegance, and a lounge jazz band. Instead, I got youthful, sweaty revelers convulsing to some ungodly noise. I shall not be making a repeat visit. This is Nigel Bickleworth on Two Point Radio. One must put up with so many offensive inventions these days. Pure travesties that belittle all of humanity. But I ask you, pork pies? What will they think of next? Undercover journalist approaching the hospital. Thank you. 
Anyone who has engaged in any sort of social interaction of late will be aware that there is a severe lack of good manners in our fair county. Since our education system seems incapable of fixing this problem, I entreat you to listen to my Sir Nigel's Guide to Good Manners series. Perhaps I alone can stem the tide of incivility. Today's sponsor is Rent an Eel. Rent an Eel for all of your short term eel based needs. This is Two Point Radio.
We ought to give thanks each day that our humble little county has attracted such giants of industry as Jumbo and some of these new upstarts. It is to these brave companies I dedicate the following song. and Wolf, and welcome to Two Point Radio for a special show presented by Bungle Kids. Listen to some music while I find out where that noise is coming from.
Yo, yo, and hello. It's the Wolfman coming at you with some kid-friendly content here on Two Point Radio. So here's some insidious advertising for the under 10s. Cheesy Gubbins contains as much milk as milk. That doesn't sound right, but they don't care, do they?
supposed to believe that raccoons are exploiting us like little furry parasites. And that's exactly why they're so effective at it. I'm petitioning for Bongo to do something useful for a change and design a raccoon resistant bin.
It's time for my earliest and fondest memory of cartoons. I remember that I used to get up early, head downstairs, and sit on the floor to watch a cast of wacky characters. All love and abstract shapes. Sure, they had their obstacles and their mishaps, but they always stuck together. It was years later that I found out the young wolf was watching static. One man's white noise is another man's entertainment. Remember that. The hospital may well be haunted.
Don't put your health in the hands of a quack. Come to Bungle Meditech, where advanced techniques and experimental treatments could make you live forever. Bungle Meditech. Other hospitals offer leeches. Ours will leave you speechless. 24 hours a day. This is Two, two, two Point Radio. Assistant required in reception. Bungle Kids is full of wonderful entertainment for all ages, but also lessons for all ages. I believe the word is parable. Hey, that's fun to say. Parable. 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 What I've learned today is that it's fun to say parable. 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 Herbal. Maintenance announcement. Toilets need routine servicing.
This is fun. We've got a message from a little Jiminy Brown Shorts. Let's see what he's got to say. Dear Harrison, what did you want to be when you were little? Well, Jiminy, when I was little, I wanted to be a lighthouse keeper. Now those guys know what's going on. Unfortunately, I was never good with stairs. Kids has given me the privilege of announcing the newest character slash snack to join the Morsel Men family. <sighs> Introducing Sean Cocktail. I'm not sure I understand this announcement or what's happening, but I can hardly contain my excitement all the same.
Roachbugger are proud to introduce our new flying sauces. Made with a secret mixture of lighter than air, gravity defying spices. Try our new flying sauces. They're out of this world! 24 hours a day. This is Two, two Point Radio.
assessment, automated snack machines need restocking manually. That's it from me, but remember to tune into Bungle Kits tomorrow where it's back to back bureaucrats all day long. If you've not seen it before, I encourage you to give it a try. No one's too old for cartoons, man. And this one's colorful, real funny, and also contains lots of great legal advice. It's helped me out on more than one occasion. a bag, grab a fork, and don't forget your eating shoes, because you're coming on a trip with Chef Ricky. Yes, it's me, Ricky Hawthorne, and today I'll be taking your taste buds all over Two Point County and talking about some of my most favorite comestible experiences.
The Flemington area is renowned for its traditional oyster stews. Unfortunately, the guide I was using was maybe a little too traditional, as the restaurant I had planned to visit moved 35 years ago. Luckily, the petrol station now at that site sold a really memorable version of that fishiest of concoctions. It just goes to show, you don't have to be picky when it comes to seafood. It's all good. Training course completed.
And now to Hogsport, and one of my favourite spots, the Oily Cormorant. You must try their rendition of the region's kidney and kidney pie, made popular, of course, during the steak drought of 1823. I'll also recommend trying their famous linseed aioli, mixed in barrels made of recycled cricket bats. Inject some chance into your life with probability, the drink that rolls the dice of life. Uh. Probability? What's the worst that can happen? 24 hours a day. This is Two, two Point Radio.
This is Ricky Hawthorne on Two Point Radio. I'm sure you've heard of smoking food, but have you heard of smogging food? It's all the rage down in, you guessed it, smogly. While it may be an acquired taste, if I've learned anything about food over the years, it's that acquired tastes are always the fanciest, and therefore the best. I tell you what I've been enjoying recently, the scribblings of one Ms. Charlatine Fishwrapper over at the Two Point Squabbler. Finally, someone writing in a fashion that I can understand. I particularly enjoyed her piece, Seven Ways to Get the Most Out of Your Coat. Now that was high quality wordsmithery. Fire in the hospital.
The Grockle Bay Bug, that ten-legged wonder, the crown jewel of our county's waters. There's something so captivating about a crustacean that you can share amongst a table of five. The shells are incredibly useful, of course. I have one at my home that I use as a rather tasteful fruit bowl. Let's talk about the Cirque de Parfait and its namesake, Semi-Solid. I wouldn't recommend eating anything but when you're there, not least to avoid disparaging looks from the patrons if you're seen eating anything with a discernible texture. It's a special moment for any Poinchon child to select a spoon and head to the flavor gazebo to make that first order. Mine was half pistachio, half liver and onions. You never forget.
Author and ambassador for the Bigfoot Foundation, Bartholomew F. Yeti is coming to talk at an artsy location near you for the 20th anniversary tour of his seminal work, Big Feet, Big Shoes. Critics call it urgent, confusing, and a nice color. Blink and you'll miss him. Buy your tickets now. This is Two Point Radio.
course completed. To finish our trip, I'd like to talk about vegetables from the southeast of our beautiful county, a region I've not yet visited. Though through my contacts in the green grossing community, I've started sourcing carrots as big as a leg and as sweet as you like. Sensational! If I knew any better, I'd say they were designed rather than grown. <laughs> Kudos to the farmers down in Camouflage Falls.
You're listening to Nigel Bickleworth on Two Point Radio. Forget all the nonsense you've heard so far. I am Nigel Bickleworth, and I'm here to restore civility to Two Point Radio. I wonder what madness Bungle Tech will dream up next. I read in the Two Point Squabbler they've managed to attach a human ear to a kettle. Another victory for the modern world, I'm sure.
sometimes wonder whether to say you and I or you and me? Congratulations, you are one of the many poorly educated louts who make life unbearable. There is a very simple formula you can apply to discover which form is the correct one, but I fear even that would be too complex for you poor souls. For yourself. Hmm. Wish you could donate all your money. Aha! Join the Orb Foundation today. The Orb is the perfect shape and the perfect solution. More two point. More often. This is two point radio.
approaching the hospital. Deluxe clinic calling doctor. Overheard two adolescents mocking a poster advertising this very radio station and yours truly. And can you believe it? They didn't even know what radio was. I'll tell you what radio is, you sultana brained miscreants. It is a delivery system for class and integrity. It is the home of the world's noblest profession. And it is the fastest growing medium among people with three figure IQs. Next up, some god-awful jingles.
For this very special edition of Sir Nigel Reviews, I visited the Seven Feet Under Funerary Home. I wish to make arrangements for my own eventual demise, and as with everything else, one must try before buying. After being buried for three hours in a variety of coffins, I finally decided on a lovely worm-resistant oak casket. Greatly recommended.
Today's guide to good manners is one that is dear to my heart. How to greet one's betters. Well, I for one would prefer you to bow, even kneel if you're up to it. Make no eye contact unless encouraged to do so. Also, do not forget that my first name is Sir. If all that is too much to remember, just don't greet me at all. At Cheesy Gubbins, our scientists take the finest gubbins and combine them with our secret generations-old cheese recipe to make those perfectly cheesy gubbins. This is Two Point Radio. Thank you. 
Ricky Hawthorne here, bringing you music, sunshine, and old fashioned charm on Two Point Radio. And we begin with a belter of a track. Hearing such wonderful music reminds me of my youth, when I could just sit quietly and listen to songs one after the other. Well, never mind. Let's listen to some more songs.
It's time for the news now. A leak has been discovered in one of the Meltdown's factories. Police say they may have to evacuate the surrounding region, which sounds like a great excuse to go on holiday for a few weeks. Lucky people! We're coming up to the top of the hour, which, if you ask me, is the very best part of the hour. I know, I know, some of you will say, but Ricky, what about the bottom of the hour? And you'd be right.
If you're feeling weighed down and clogged up with bad things, why not rinse yourself out by drinking swill? Our mixture of compressed plant matter will go straight through you, taking with it the poisons of everyday life and much, much more. <laughs> Thanks, swill. May cause unsolicited and incessant excretion. This is Two Point Radio. Jumbo Medical Solutions has introduced a wonderful new feature in all their hospitals. At one press of a button, bedridden patients can now order any Jumbo product and have it flown in by drone directly to their room. How's that for convenient? Automated snack machine. 
machines need restocking manually. the air with Ricky Hawthorne. Well, actually, I'm the one who's on the air. You're just listening to me being on the air. You're listening to the air.
Some good advice from George Bristles, who sent in this quote. If at first you fail, be thankful that you have friends. Watching them fail too will make you feel better. He's right, you know. Thinking for yourself? Hmm. Wish you could donate all your money. Aha! Join the Orb Foundation today. The Orb is the perfect shape and the perfect solution. More Two Point. More often. This is Two Point Radio.
Two Point Radio. Harrison Wolf here on Two Point Radio. Remember, I'm not here to entertain you. I'm here to entertain myself. And wolf. I don't know what my time traveling future self is up to, but my arm just disappeared.
machines need restocking manually. If you're unlucky enough to get sick, my advice, don't turn to Jumbo Medical Solutions. Their hospitals are well equipped, it's true, but what's the use of healing your body if you have to sell your soul, right?
and Wolf on Two Point Radio. The band claims the song you just heard was composed in outer space, somewhere around the second moon of Jupiter. That's the small one. You probably never heard it. Adrastia. Of course, maybe they just drank too many cans of pulpitation. If you're looking for a product with which to clean your hair, we at Justa would like to ask that you consider our shampoo. Yeah, all right. Justa shampoo. It'll clean your hair, but it won't change your life. Serving Two Point County. This is Two Point Radio.
So I have a new hobby now, beekeeping. I only have three bees for now, not as easy to catch as you'd think, but I'm looking forward to all that sweet, sweet honey. And here's a sweet, sweet melody for you all. I don't often do this, but here is the weather report. A purple contentment seeps through the pores of Croc and Bush. A vast cloud of inexperienced crows gathers for the annual feast over flattering. And finally, the tears of a clown swell to a tide down the streets of Grockle Bay. The next weather report will be in 17 years.
research. as libraries and museums. On the way, more tunes to make your head explode. Thank you. 
here's this week's unbelievable offers at Crumley Mega Market. Buy 115 cans of tuna and, and get, get one free. And if you sign up for our store card, you'll get our exclusive one-time use Crumley can opener. So come on down to Crumley Mega Market in Duckworth upon Bilge. Serving Two Point County. This is Two Point Radio. It is time to leave the woes of your petty, pointless little lives behind and listen to the fountainhead of wisdom that is I, Sir Nigel Bickleworth, here on Two Point Radio. Thank you. 
If you're thinking of checking yourself into a Holistics Commune or purchasing one of their many risible products, I can save you the considerable expense. And now, my ever-popular guide to good manners, in which I turn my attention to wedding etiquette. The first step should always be to decline the invitation. Should that prove impossible, perhaps you are the best man or have not offend the groom, then pay attention to every detail of the ceremony and banquet so you may later criticize them in a loud, obnoxious voice.
Nigel Bickleworth on Two Point Radio. We continue our efforts to improve our listeners' minds with another lesson in the correct usage of English grammar. If you ever write defiantly when you mean definitely, I shall hunt you down and beat you about the head with an umbrella. How's that for defiant? always wanted a place to call your own. Good morning! Somewhere that somehow mixes the cool of the city <laughs> with the calm of the countryside. Welcome to Camouflage Falls. Coming soon to Two Point County. Camouflage Falls. Definitely what we say it is. This is Two Point Radio.
Today, I shall be reviewing the new driverless limousine service, Ruder. Exquisite luxury, no annoying chit-chat, and a driving program designed to inconvenience all other motorists. Other than the journey ending by veering off a cliff, I can thoroughly recommend it. If I sound particularly unctuous today, it is perhaps due to my new imported cashmere seat warmer. Never has my posterior been so impeccably toasty. I pity all you impoverished listeners whose hindquarters shall never know such opulence. <laughs> 